Odoo 11 Essentials Section 6 Adding Business Intelligence to your module In this section we're going to take a look at Writing your first function for Odoo 11 Calculated fields using the first function Adding a API.depends function and learning the use of it API.1, self.ensure1 and API.model explained Why we use these statements and where Writing your first function for Odoo 11 What you will learn in this video First, writing a def or a function Next, we're going to add a button to call the function And then we're going to check if it works or debugging is needed Let's start Writing a def function What we need to do is to open the new module That we have written before and have worked on and we need to open it in the code editor and we're going to edit the phonebook.pu file and then we're going to enter this code so pause this video and write it in the phonebook.pu so we open new module and then we open phonebook.pu and here right after the definition of the fields we're go going to enter the code we're going to save this Next, we need to add a button to call the function so that we can see if the function works. So, the new model has been opened in the code editor. We're going to edit the file phonebook underscore view dot xml and we're going to enter the code in the form view. It says button name equals print name. The string will be print and type is object so that it knows that a Python function needs to be called. So here in views, I'm going to open phonebookview.xml and here in the form view that we have written before, I'm going to enter the code for the button. I'm going to save this. Now we need to check if the button works. I'm going to restart Odoo 11 or start it if it's not started. And then we're going to update the new module and then open a phone book record and we're going to click the button and see if it works so here I have logged into the demo database I'm going to apps I will search for our module right here going to upgrade now going to phone book records I'm going to open up a record let's say new name here we can see there is a new button which says print I'm going to click it OK, so it's new name, should be Inodo. OK, this is name of record, new name. This means that our function works and it is reading the name of the record. 